A disturbing story out of Wisconsin, yet another unarmed black man shot. Disturbing video last night showed Jacob Blake unarmed being shot by police. A black man, father of three, shot in the back at close range in front of his three children. He was unarmed. President Trump still has not commented on what happened to Jacob Blake, the unarmed black man. We all saw it. A man who appears to be completely unarmed. I agree that before any verdict come down, comes down, there needs to be an investigation. Uh, but I don't understand why expressing sympathy for what happened and outrage that once again an unarmed black man is shot. Uh, we won't know until the investigation is completed well, whether there was a firearm in the, in the vehicle or not. I don't know. There is some new audio between Blake and investigators that happened during an interview shortly after the shooting of Jacob Blake. Jacob Blake is talking about a knife that the DA says he admitted to having. Yeah, it was on the floor. I was on the floor? Where on the floor? Like, kind of damn near under my car. Oh, okay. When did they get there? Because I told you when they first grabbed me, they grabbed me with my arm. I took it out of my pocket and I dropped it. Oh, you know okay. Saying? I realized I had dropped my knife. That little pocket knife. So I picked it up after I got off of him. I shouldn't have picked it up. Only considering what was going on. Shooting of Jacob Blake, uh, unarmed, a black man in the back, although he, he did have a, a knife in his car, I guess. Overnight, <laughs> chaos on the streets of Kenosha, Wisconsin. Multiple buildings set on fire, including a Wisconsin Department of Corrections building. At the city's courthouse, a dump truck set on fire and water bottles hurled at officers in riot gear, who then fired tear gas at the crowds. As we stand in solidarity for Nike, what is his name? We understand one thing and two for certain, that we ain't taking no for an answer. We done begging, we done pleading, until we get justice, we gonna shut this mother down. Just arrived in Kenosha, Wisconsin, and this is the aftermath from last night. All these cars are torched. That's, uh, see, that's the name of the business here. Let's see if we can get a little zoom in. Car source pre owned vehicles. I knew it was going to be a disaster, but I didn't know what a disaster looked like until I saw it. It's emotionally hurtful. Uh, but we didn't do anything to anybody.